Chemistry is something I've been very interested in since I was a very young kid. Growing up with parents who were scientists, I was constantly exposed to cool demonstrations and experiments. When I got to high school, I entered a competition called Chemistry Olympiad. I was one of the top four students in the nation, and I got to represent the United States at the International Chemistry Olympiad. There, I won a silver medal for America. Even though Team USA did a really good job at the international competition, STEM education in our country is currently lagging. There are a lot of things we could be doing much better. So I wanted to find a way to improve our education system to allow more students to become introduced to science, technology, engineering, and math, especially at the young ages. I came up with the idea of a chemistry magic show, and I got together a group of very passionate students to work on this. I wasn't sure what response we would get, but once we started reaching out to the schools, we knew that they needed a service like what we provide. They needed a place for their students to go to, to become inspired by science. Our magic shows are a set of really fun experiments for the kids, including an American flag demonstration, to oscillating chemical reactions, and even blowing up hydrogen balloons. So what's unique about our show is that the kids don't really watch the show, uh, they're actively participating in the show, coming up as volunteers and performing the magic. Even though we've gone to many schools, we wanted to focus on schools that don't have the same resources that we do. This is a 100% free lunch school area. So 100% of the students are under the poverty line. Science and math is one of the things that's lacking in the United States, as you know. And one of the big things that you're doing is um, inspiring little ones mm -hmm. to become scientists in the future. Uh, we are a Title I school with low income, um, but one of the things we don't let that be a drawback, we use that as an opportunity to provide as much as we can for those kids to open up all the different doors of opportunity. I think the kids loved it. I know the kids loved it. <laughs> I got to watch all the assemblies and the kids were more excited than I've seen them in a long time. And just seeing the interest in their face and their excitement and to be honest, when, when questions were being you know, asked, so many hands went up which told me, okay, our kids are involved. Our goal at Catalyst for Success is to get more kids involved with STEM education. I know that our show is very inspiring, but inspiration can only go so far without any hands-on activities for the kids, where they can really dig into the materials. That's why we implemented the second component of our program. At the hands-on activities, the kids get to try out really engaging and interactive experiments, including chromatography and titration. More bits, right? So do you guys want to know how this happens? Yes! Building on the interest from the magic shows, we teach the kids laboratory skills and how to apply the scientific method. So, now what do you guys think? This is where we can get the most impact. Our magic shows are a great service, but these hands-on activities where the kids can create their own experiments and develop their own passion for science, that's where we can make the biggest difference. Why hasn't this been thought of before? I bet you it has, it just hasn't been used by high school students to go down and work with elementary school students or middle school students. Doing what you're doing, inspiring those students to consider, wow, science looks really, really cool. I thought it was fantastic. It really brought to life science for our students. They're just starting to learn about chemistry. I think they loved it. I'm sure if I asked any of the kids out there, in fact, I asked a few on the way out, they were all like, that was cool. To get the kids excited so that they're the ones that are asking the questions, they're wanting to learn more. We were blown away by the response we received from the kids. They sent us drawings and emails telling us how much they loved it. The fact that what we did made them want to become scientists really means that we're achieving our goals. In our program, not only do the young students learn, the members of Catalyst for Success, they learn from the experience as well. Being a part of Catalyst has taught me how to work in a professional environment. Uh, communication skills, meeting deadlines, skills that I wouldn't learn anywhere else as a high school student. So now I'm more comfortable speaking with adults. I can perform in front of large crowds without feeling scared. I've seen them 
grow more confident. I've seen their responsibility level increase. I've seen their communication skills improve. And these are skills that will really carry them in the future. Any type of exposure, especially coming from students like yourself, it's a great opportunity for them to see that um, there's hope in this world. At the end of every show, we always ask the kids, How many of you guys want to be scientists now? Yeah? <laughs>